Good morning. Welcome back. 545 on your Thursday. And here's a look at our top headlines. It looks like the nation is a step closer to getting a new attorney general. Today, the Senate unanimously approved a bill to combat human trafficking. The vote ends a battle between Republicans and Democrats over an amendment attached to that bill that had to do with funding abortions. Yesterday's vote also ends the stalemate over the confirmation of Loretta Lynch as the new attorney general. Republicans refused to allow a confirmation vote until the Senate finished with the anti-trafficking bill. A big decision in the class action lawsuit against the NFL over concussions. A federal judge approved a settlement granting up to $5 million to each retired player for serious medical conditions associated with repeated head trauma. Thousands of former players sued, accusing the NFL of hiding the dangers of concussions. The settlement applies to all players who retired on or before July 7, 2014. It also applies to the family members of players who died before that date. And take a look at this time-lapsed video of floodwaters rising at a train station in Sydney, Australia. You can see the water moving in and it's quickly engulfing the tracks, rising as high as the train platform. Severe weather conditions battering Sydney and surrounding areas have killed four people since Monday. Wow, that did escalate quickly.